Hi guys. Got Drew here, finally made it in from LA. Say hi. Hey. Anyway, Drew, why don't I put you over here? So I just want to take a second and show people what we've been working on. <coughs> Quiet, cat, I'm making a video. Check it out right here. Killer's mask. The killer in the movie is basically the umpire, so he controls the game and decides who lives and who's out. This is his antique umpire's mask. I show people this mask and everyone's like, oh, that's pretty creepy. Uh, where'd you find it? How did you get that? Came from this suitcase right here. Ooh, nice suitcase, huh? I found this thrifting and basically cut it into tons of pieces, fabricated the entire thing myself, all from different parts of the suitcase. This right here, that's actually the handle. So that's how I carry the mask. Moving on, shh, I'm trying to show them how to make all these things. For the killer's weapon, we have little league size bat. Start with that, sand it all down, stain it, antique, vintage, old school. Take regular nails, drill holes all the way through this. We decided to combine two of America's favorite pastimes, baseball and slasher movies. Shh. I'm in the middle of telling them what's going on here. Now that we have all the nails in there, wanted to add an extra element of surprise. A bolt action, long knife blade in a nail filled killer's bat. This is the real bat for all the close ups. But we also need a foam version for all the stunts. You can hit everyone with this. Constructed out of a foam noodle that you can get at pretty much any store, PVC piping for stability. From there, just took a blade and carving away, just getting it close to the same shape as the regular bat, then took duct tape and tightly wrapped it so it had a really fine seam. And then when you paint over the whole thing, you're left with this. Shh, the last time. Clip the tips, you get that nice square pointy edge. Then to get the blood effect, you run a tube like this through the middle PVC, hide it in here with the paint, cut a couple little holes in there, attach something like this, and just squeeze the blood out. So as you can see, we've got a lot of cool stuff going on here and we're making new stuff every single day. We've got a lot of great donations from all of you out there so far, but the rest of you, come on in on the fun. With your help and your donations out there, we're gonna bring this baby to life. If we don't make our goal, there's no movie. Shh. And we already got these sweet weapons. I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna have to use them one way or another. And if you don't pledge, then I'm gonna have to kill this goddamn cat!